Hi guys, my name is Alicia. My name is Leticia. And welcome, welcome back, back to our, our channel. channel. Oh, so for today's video, we're gonna do a get ready with us. Yes. We're just gonna be talking to you guys while we're getting ready. Um, we are gonna go to the mall later, so So that's you know. why we did our makeup. Yes. Um, we both have exciting news. Yes. As you guys can tell, we got our, our braces, braces off. off. I mean, I had my braces off before she did, but like, you know, we I haven't know. been filming. I didn't. So. We did film other videos. It's just like, we didn't like them. There's always problems with them. Yeah, we didn't like the way they so turned we, out. Yeah. The voice, you could barely hear us or something. We're talking over each other. We have a bad habit of doing that. Yeah, we just like to ramble and then one will start talking and then yes. the other one will just chime in. But that's how we were like, that's how we've always been. So yes. it's really hard not to do that. And I feel like it's kind of annoying so we didn't want to put that out there like that we're just gonna post i feel like we're too hard on ourselves yeah i feel like we are too hard on ourselves like we just need to do this and just post if you guys have any suggestions please let us know yeah. what you guys want to watch and down. we will film it for you guys leave them down in the comments down below yes. and we'll get back to you guys if you guys want to see how we got our looks then keep watching so um, um we already started with our eyebrows yes we already did our eyebrows my eyebrows came out so good today i'm actually really happy I'm having a good brow day because you know sometimes yes. you're just like oh like you want to redo it yeah but today I feel it. like my eyebrows are looking pretty good I'm not Same. even mad can't, can't even complain mad. about mine yeah. I'm just gonna jump right into it so um what kind of look are you gonna go for I'm gonna go well you know I always say I'm gonna go for a natural look and then something just takes over and it always ends up being dramatic Same. so we'll see we'll, we'll just see, see how, how it ends goes. up so I'm gonna brush I'm gonna conceal with the Tarte um, Rainforest of the Sea just because this is a light um, concealer. It's so easy to blend. And it's hydrating. That one's yeah. very, very hydrating. And, and it's so this. thin. It's not thick. But if you want coverage, go with the Tarte Shape Tape. It has never done you wrong. Yeah, for real. I'm gonna go in with the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer. I love this concealer because I have dark circles. We naturally Same. have a little like dark circles, but it also doesn't help that we barely see. Yeah, and it's been finals week. We look like shit. You know, you know how it is. Finals, everyone's yeah. stressed out. No one's. Good. I've actually been breaking out like so bad. I don't know if you guys can see that. Like, and I never really had acne. I've had breakouts, but not acne. I'm so happy that my skin looks so good. I'm not trying to jinx myself, but my skin has been looking so good. I used to break out like all over. But yeah, we've been so stressed out with finals, or at least I. Oh have. my god, I look. So so crazy. I put a shit down. I put a lot on me. I always on. start off with my eyebrows and I bring down my concealer to my eyelids. I already concealed my eyebrows, so now I'm just going to conceal my eyelids. Create a base for my eyeshadow. I am so excited for finals to be over. It's basically over for us. Today, we had our last psychology test. I'm just so excited for Christmas. I feel like... Me too. I've been in the Christmas spirit and I'm kind of mad that like... I haven't. Yeah. She has it. I was like, get on board with me, okay? I'm not I know. To... I'm going to go in. I'm going to use my soft glam palette because I haven't used this palette in a while. It's been oh. a little minute, so I'm going to go in with this palette. What kind of tones are you going for? Um, warm tones, obviously, because, you know, I can't do anything else. Or should I go with, like, pink? Mm, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I've kind of been loving the natural eyebrow, so I don't think I'm going to conceal above my eyebrow just to make it look a little more natural. Yeah, I feel like that like, looks pretty. Yeah, I just cleaned up the bottom a little bit, and then um, I think I'm going to leave it like that. Yeah, I'm just going in with an orange shade from the palette. I feel like that's the best like um, transition color Oh yeah. for like any gold looks, any warm tones. I just love to do that in general. I feel like it just kind of like warms up your like I don't know what it does like if you have brown eyes I think that is a beautiful transition shade I feel like it really brings out your brown eyes let's talk about how we got into makeup yes so we were never allowed to wear makeup we weren't our, our parents were very strict and um I don't know I feel like we're the type like if someone says I can't do something, it's just going to make me want to do even more. So I feel like that yes. just, like, I wanted to learn more. So we were just on YouTube, and, you know, we would, like, research all this stuff. I would ask my mom and my aunt, like, specific terms. Obviously, they didn't know what I was talking about because um, they knew about makeup, but not like that. Like, not in depth, how I wanted to learn it. 
So I think it started um, from there and then we just started practicing every day. Um, funny stories. So we're gonna talk about our worst makeup moments. Yes. So one of my worst makeup moments is when, so in middle school we went to a private school and um, a lot of girls, I don't know if this was a, if during like that time period, I would see a lot of YouTubers do this, like Bethany Mona and stuff. They would take like a sham, I remember this, it was a sham oh, champagne, champagne color, color, put it on your lid. But the thing is, we weren't allowed to wear makeup, so I couldn't wear mascara or eyeliner. That was no, it. I didn't know how to do it. So I would literally just take on my tan ass skin, okay, I would take white eyeshadow and just like leave it there like that. And I thought it looked bomb. <laughs> I thought it looked popping. No one told me I looked horrible. Oh my gosh. And it worked for like girls with more fair skin. And I used the whitest like champagne eyeshadow you could think of. And I just left it there on my eyelids. And I was like, ooh, she looks good. She looks popping. Like, <laughs> I think my worst one is, um, what's it called? Not having the right, like, foundation color yes we like, did that too it was bad it was so bad like i remember in the beginning we grabbed a bb cream and that was so bad because it was not our skin tone and uh, not just that it was like foundations too we didn't know how to color um match ourselves yeah no but i'm gonna talk about the first one okay so the first one we bought this um this bb cream that was so dark for our skin tone like we don't even know why like i don't even know why we even bought that um, and we went to a private school so we weren't allowed to wear makeup like you're not allowed to because like you know god created you like a beautiful way or like we yeah were little, like i don't know but school did not allow you to wear makeup. you would get in trouble and this was middle school and um yeah you would get in trouble you could get like written up but every single girl in our grade would have like foundation. Foundation BB cream. The something. same white eyeshadow too. It's just that they had pale skin, so you couldn't see it that much. Anyway, so a bunch of girls would wear foundations and BB creams, and you know, like you're not supposed to wear that. So like that was like cool that like you could, you know. And we bought one. It was way too dark for our skin. It just oxidized so bad. No, it wasn't that it was really too dark. I mean, yeah, it was dark, but it oxidized so bad. So our face looked orange at the, like at the end of the day. It didn't oh look like that in the morning. It did not left. look like that in the morning. Oh my gosh. That was so embarrassing. And like another thing too is like since I thought that it was too dark, so I was like, okay, I need a lighter foundation that um I bought a BB cream that was way too light for my skin tone. Like I remember we were getting ready for a dance and I and um a couple girls from our school and you know we were all friends, so we were getting ready together. We we're like, oh my gosh, we'll get ready. And we weren't allowed to wear that much makeup, but, you know, we still did. And it was a BB cream, and then my friend was like, oh, can I borrow some? So my friend was white, and she took my BB cream, and it matched her skin perfectly. So I looked like a ghost wearing it. Like, that was so embarrassing. <laughs> Me too. Like, but we didn't notice it. Like, I don't know why we didn't realize these things. Yeah. I feel like everyone goes through, like, a bad makeup phase. Yeah, everyone has to go through, like, their embarrassing makeup phase. I'm kind of glad though. It's Mine even now. I feel like everybody like knows how to do makeup now. Yeah, but you Especially know, middle schoolers. Oh my gosh. I don't know, but um, that's because they have like all of these like, like tools, resources. Like you yeah. know what I mean. Like they that we start, didn't have back then. Everybody starts wearing makeup at a young age. Mhm. Mm like we weren't allowed to wear mascara right. in middle school. We weren't allowed to because we had beautiful long eyelashes. And like you know what? I thank my mom to this day because for not letting us wear makeup. Yeah, or especially mascara because um. We have long eyelashes, and they're still long to this day, but they were beautiful. They were curled, everything. They were so and long. And they're not that long anymore, and they're not that pretty and curly how they used to be. So, and it's because we would wear mascara. Mm hmm The first time I wore mascara, I, like, couldn't believe my eyes. Like, Same. Like, I felt kind of uncomfortable because they looked Same. fake they to me. Fake. So, the camera died on us, so that's why I look more put together than I did before. Yes. If there's like a big drastic change, it's because of that. So we were talking about powders, translucent powders. I really like the Kylie one, like I said. Oh my god, I look so crazy right now. Just trying to clean up my contour. I know, I think I'm gonna do the same thing. This is my old translucent powder, so if you see me like 
I'm barely getting anything. Oh, see, there we go. Oh, shit, I'm running hella low on my credit. I didn't even know that. But I had it for a while, so I'm kind of glad that like, it lasted this long. I'm going to highlight now. I'm going to borrow her. Yes. I love this stuff. This is the MAC. Um, what is it called? Give me Stan Bronzer. Oh, I love that. Mm -hmm. I use a Too Faced one and this one. When I do my makeup with her. If not, I'll just use my Too Faced one. My favorite highlighter at the moment, honestly, I feel like ever since I got it, is the um, Desi Times Katie um, highlighter. Highlighter. I so yeah, nice. I use it like every single day. Oh, I think I did a little too much. <laughs> a little too much what? Bronzer. The bronzer. <laughs> <laughs> Can I use your mascara? I'm going for a bronzer. I do like Holy shit. Thanks. My favorite mascara, or both our favorite mascaras, is the um, Lash Sensational Mascara by Maybelline. This just does wonders to your eyelashes. If you have curly, long eyelashes, like, this is all you need. I need to buy a new mascara. I'm pretty sure you've already bought, like, two or three. And I've had the same dry-ass one. Ew. I think, I know my lashes are long, but I think I'm going to wear lashes today. I know, I think I want to do lashes too. I haven't done makeup in so long so might as well go on blush. Oh you guys, this is my this is my favorite blush. This is the Oh, me too. This is the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Wear found, Foundation Blush. This is amazing. Um, This is the only blush that These actually scissors, lasts so on my scared. Yeah, I definitely do. I knew we were going to do eyelashes. Oh, bad ass scissors. I love those scissors. Well, yours are good. You gave me the shitty ones. Yeah, no. When we used to share makeup, she took the good ones. <laughs> don't act like you know you've never done that too. You take it and you're like, it's mine. Like, <laughs> like you claim it. So I'm gonna go in with the Lily Lashes in the style of Goddess. These are so pretty. Definitely recommend for Christmas. If you wanna buy me some lashes, that'd be great. Nice. The because you have some lashes. Yeah, oh, that's lashes, like, okay. affordable. Those are nice too. I love Lily lashes, but they're a little too they expensive. Are. This is for why me. I only buy them on Black Friday. So like, not a dupe, but a really good eyelash brand. Like, if you want like really pretty dramatic eyelashes that um aren't that expensive, I would go with Hassel Lashes. My favorite favorite styles is Iconic Lights or the Allura Lights. They always have my Ulta. So good. I highly recommend them. Before you guys put on your lashes, Ooh, don't so forget funny. cut them. I'm pretty sure difference. a lot of people have stressed this. Yes. Cut your lashes. Cut your lashes. That's the main thing that's going to make your lashes either look really good or really, like, bad. Because it makes your eyes look droopy and it makes them look heavy and it's just It, like, cute. closes off your lash. I mean, your eye. Wait, clean so, what you want to do is take here? your lash. I just cut these to my size. You want to place it on your lash line. And they're not supposed to go all the way to your inner corner. They're supposed to go, like, I heard, like, three quarters out. And the excess, you just cut off. Um, I always totally just cut on the side. The so these video. fit me pretty good. They're supposed to be comfortable. You're not supposed to feel your lashes. If you if they feel uncomfortable or, like, if something's poking you, you need to cut up. You need to cut your lashes, girl. I'm a gloss type of girl. She always does matte lips. I mean, they look really good on my skin. No, I love, no, I try to do matte lips, but then but at the end so of the day, thank you. What are you wearing? I'm wearing um, strip down and then NARS, good times. That looks really pretty. Thank you. Especially with your eye look and your cardigan. Yes. I'm not I'm I don't a do very dark, dark lip person. I love this color. I think it's really pretty. Can I see my, oh, never mind. You know what's the worst feeling? When you have somewhere to go. Your lashes are drying, <laughs> and then all of a sudden, it's missing. <laughs> Has that ever happened to you? <laughs> what do you mean it's missing now? Like, it got stuck to you and <laughs> fell on the ground. <laughs> it's a wet no. lash, too. <laughs> and I had someone to go. I wanted to cry. No. Where? It's happened way too many times. Because I'd always put them on the end of my um of my palette, my Jaclyn Hill palette. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I would either, like, um, pick it up with my elbow on accident. 
or like it'd fall on the floor or freaking Ollie would come and like blow it off the, my desk. You know when Ollie comes in too excited? Yeah. That's in my lashes and his like breath, like he blew one off my desk and I was so... <laughs> <laughs> Another tip with lashes, do not put them on right away. You have oh, to wait sorry, for them to get tacky. Are you okay? Yeah. Your lashes look so pretty. You don't even need them. Oh, a blend. I know. I was debating on putting on lashes. You don't even need lashes. It looks so pretty. Thank you. I am just because I did a dramatic wing eyeliner and the white eyeshadow. So I will. I kind of do want to put on lashes, so. I mean, put them on. But, you know. I haven't done make them how long, so I will. Yeah, I'm going to put on my lashes on, too. I'm going to be using my Ardell Wispies because these are super cute. They don't make my lashes longer, but they do make them fuller just because I already have long eyelashes. But you know, when if you just want a little bit more dramatic and a little bit more volume, these are a great lash to wear. <gasps> I glued it. What? I'm missing an eyelash. What do you mean? Like this is the left one. And did you move the right one? I think I put it right here. I don't think so. I could. I think you did. <laughs> Speaking <laughs> of, <laughs> when I told you what happened to my eyelash. I told you. I told you. I was just talking about that too. I'm gonna borrow your eyelash glue. See how it works. See how I like it. Do you like this? Have you tried it? I do. That they put me on. I love that my man's is so patient with me when I have to put on my lashes. There's times where like my eyelash is about to fall off, and he'll wait for me in the car while I reapply him. Well, he doesn't want me looking busted. I know. No, oh, that's so sweet. A lot of people think you're like, oh my gosh, you guys are like the same person. But yeah. we do have different personalities. Like, oh my gosh, you guys wear, your makeup seems the same, even though it's like it's slightly not. different. It's not. It's like, slightly different. I feel like she likes more natural, soft glam. Yes. That's her. She like a little more dramatic. I like it more dramatic. Do you use like more color and stuff like that? I'm really digging your makeup. Really? Thank yes. you. Yes. I really like it. Honestly, sometimes I like um, a thicker band because, like, this is so thin that sometimes I will glue it to my end of my eyelashes instead of, like, my freaking eyelid. I really like this makeup. I think it's, like, natural but, like, glam. Can I go to the mall with you guys? Yeah. Because I'm not here with anyone. I just didn't know if you wanted to. Um, I don't care. I don't feel weird. I don't feel weird either. I think it's we're sisters, and we're, like, so close, like... When I would, when I would, actually, no, I think it's just me in general. Because when, um, I would always tag along with my brother and my team. Yeah. I didn't care either. Yeah, I don't, I feel like I don't get weird with, like, with third wheeling. I feel like I was Some so people. used to it at one point. <laughs> no, I don't care at this point. I'm actually super, I was super excited to do my makeup. I haven't done it in, like, forever. I know. I love doing my makeup. So oh, when I'm in, like, a good mood and when I'm not being rushed. When you're being rushed, doing your makeup is the worst thing I got. That's when you, like, mess up the most. I mess up the most. <laughs> <laughs> I hate you. I'm going to watch this. You know today. what I look you want? What? Chick-fil-A. But I'm broke. I should not be, like... I don't want Chick-fil-A. I've had it too many times now. I just... Nope. I do. I've been craving it. This is a highlighting palette by MAC. Look at these colors. Hold on. This is such a YouTuber thing. It works, the focus thing. I'm going to be using the shade in the middle. Why do you think they did it? Just for show or what? <laughs> no, I just like, I felt like a YouTuber. Like, oh, yes. And it's called Get It Glow. She told me to throw this out, but then I wouldn't know the um, names. Names. You're welcome. I love it. It's so pretty. She bought me this for Christmas last year, right? Mm-hmm. Bro, I can see my mustache. I'm so funny. <laughs> The girl that said that on Twitter, that said, <laughs> she's like, I've been, um, what did she say? She's like, oh, I've been so focused on finals, I just realized I had a mustache or something like that. I'm like, I think, take care of my mustache. We all have one, guys. We all have we one. We all have one. Don't act like you so. Especially if you're Mexican. Yeah, if you're Mexican or, you know, you know the struggle. That's all I'm saying, you know. Oh, thank you for the kisses. <gasps> but don't draw my pants. Uh, okay. okay. This is our okay. Kyle. This is Oliver. This is Ollie. Hi. Say hi, hi to the camera. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. When she does her makeup, this is what he does. He all just the time. sits on her. He lays on my lap. I love you. 
my baby. Why is he wet? He's wet? Yeah. Oh, he's probably outside. Oh, I'm going to smell like wet dog. <laughs> it's okay. I love him. Is this, is this mine? Yes. Is this stripped out? It is. Yeah. Do you have uh, my dark one? Or are you putting I put it back. Oh! Okay, um, can you tell me my lipstick? I don't know if I'm gonna leave my lipstick like this or if I want to um You actually look bomb like that. Really? Thank mm. you. It looks so good with your makeup. I need to clean this up because look at this. It just looks pretty since you don't have eyeliner. It just looks like a fluttery, like pretty See that's what I love. Like that natural like but yet glam. But yet natural look. Yeah. You know your girl got her hip lip gloss on. Do a touch of blush, just a pinch. Why am I talking about this? Where's your blush? I have no idea. Which one is my concealer? Oh, that's not mine. This is mine. There's no I said I was gonna add a pinch of blush. I think I overdid it. This okay. This is our finished look. Yes. As you can tell, we are different. I we do are more, different. I feel like, of a natural glam, you know? She does soft, soft glam. glam. Yeah. I do more dramatic. This is kind of softer for me. I like to, like, blend out colors. I go for more, like, um, colorful yes. tones. I don't know. We have different She styles. sticks to, like, warm tones, yes. like, browns, kind of neutral like tones. I like it. It's really pretty. Well, this is our finished look, look, you guys. As you can tell, we are different. Yes. If you guys want to see us do like a full like makeup tutorial, just let us know in the yes. comments down below. Let us know what you guys want to watch. And thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And catch us in our next video. Bye. Bye